The port. Captain, sir, we had him. We did. Found his bike still smoking. I bet you lost him, huh? No, sir. I mean, yeah, we lost him. We ran into a rager, sir. Where's Mullins? Flores? Flores is dead, sir. I'll have Mullins with a body. That'll be all, Corporal. Go get some fuel. Head back to Mullins. You know what to do. Yeah. Yes, sir. If it wasn't for this man, we'd all be dead, sir. I sort of promised him some food and a safe place to camp tonight, sir. Corporal, get the fuck out of here. And you are? Name's Deacon St. John. Name's Corey. Derek Corey. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, I'm sorry, I'm a little tired. I've been on the road for a long time. Your man Russell said you were recruiting. Well, are you interested? I've been looking to settle down. Yeah, find a camp. I'm interested. Come on. Here, take this. Militia script, camp credits. Payment for helping my men. Use them at any of the commissaries. Okay. You gonna join up? Stick around. We're getting ready to ride out of here soon. Getting ready to ride out where? You said you had some tracking skills. Yeah, some. This isn't the life of a drifter. We're fighting a war out here. You sure you're up for it? Is that the best you got? I can recruit you. But the colonel is the only one who can swear you in. You stick around. Give us a hand. I'll take you to him myself. I'll be here. Good. Hey. Uh, you don't look very militia to me. No, um, man. Name's Wade. Wade Taylor. You can call me Wade. Deacon St. John. <laughs> Holy Listen. shit! Deacon St. John? Is your old man a preacher or something? No. Man, that is a hell of a name. All right, listen. You wait. see this, man? This is some crazy shit. Yeah. Whew. So what, you joining up, becoming an army man? You playing soldier and shit? I don't know, maybe. Listen, mm -hmm. uh, you look like you just came in from out the shit, right? Yeah, man, yesterday. Okay, yesterday. I've, been I've been waiting to see the colonel, whatever the hell that is. Traveling with some people, we got separated. You see anyone that looked like this around here? Uh, nah, man. Ooh, she is a looker. I'd hit that, you know. <laughs> uh, I gotta go, man. They're checking me for lice or some shit. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Jesus, what a name. Getting ready to ride out. Are you still coming? Ready when you are. So you put a lot of work into this. Yeah, some. Captain's here. It's done, sir. Make sure you make a marker. Yes, sir. All right. You two head back to Diamond Lake. Grab, uh, Taylor was his name? Yes, sir. Yeah. Take him to the Colonel. I'll be there in 1800. Sir? Military time, Corporal. You're supposed to know this by now. Oh, yes, sir. Get the fuck out of here. Yes, sir. You find something? Uh, how long is, uh, Vasquez? How long has Vasquez been with you guys? Couple of weeks, maybe more. <laughs> well, he's been busy. What the hell? You guys been having trouble with supply runs, marauder attacks? Yeah. Okay, we're gonna go on foot from here. On foot? Why? <laughs> because Vasquez came out here for a reason. I can't track him from the bike. God. What do you think? Is anyone else tracking him? Not that I know of. Huh. Well, then he's either dead, or he's got a lot of friends. You see how his tracks have been overridden by bikes. A lot of bikes. Hmm. Okay. Come on. 
Let's see where they're heading. Do you see your man? Yeah. That's him. Oh, looks like you guys need to start doing background checks on your recruits. He seems to be right at home. Well, let's wait here. I'll radio for backup. Get your goddamn hands off me! Oh, oh this one's a fighter, boys! What do you think? Oh, come on, boss. Oh, we'll see about that. Oh, hell no. What? Uh, I just got this problem with assholes who hurt unarmed women. I'm giving you an order. Order? You see me wearing a red armband? You don't give me orders yet. You do whatever the hell you want. We brought up your bikes, Captain. Thought we'd save you the walk back. That'll be all, Corporal. So how'd I do? Did I pass? Pass? Oh, you've been watching me all day. I figured this was what? Some kind of test. <laughs> no. Nothing quite as formal as all that. As you can see, our pool of recruits isn't what it used to be. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, you passed. Oh. You ready to meet the Colonel? <laughs> yeah, sure. Why the hell not? So, are you familiar with this area? Yeah, I grew up in a town north from here. Uh, it's called Farewell, you know it? No. Uh, it sounds like a fitting place to be living at the end of the world. <laughs> yeah, tell me about it. So maybe you have been here before. Yeah, I've been here. Uh, a few summers back, me and my old lady, or my wife, we stopped by here on our honeymoon. You got a pic? Uh, of your wife, I mean. My name was Carrie. We were married 12 years when... Anyway, it was a long time ago. Oh, you guys are taking this shit seriously. The Colonel believes with enough motivation and discipline, we can achieve anything. Come on, hurry your ass up! I'm going as fast as I can! Just move it! Is that your idea of motivation? The Colonel has set up a work camp on the south side of the island for those unfit to serve. Some of them require extra encouragement. I'll bet. Come on, follow me. Yes, sir. Go. Go. Hey, what's going on? Captain? Dr. Jimenez has been murdered. What? And the son of a bitch. Jesus Christ, slit his throat from here to Where's here. Where's Taylor? Did, did Taylor see anything? All the narcotics in the camp are gone. Taylor. This one's on me. I assigned him to the infirmary. Well, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying Taylor was a junkie. You knew? Doesn't matter anymore. Taylor. Huh? Dickens, St. John. How are we doing, Taylor? <laughs> that fucked up, man. I didn't mean to kill him, man. He wasn't supposed to be there. I... <laughs> Doc was a good guy, man. He fucking, he fucking helped me. He helped me. Come on, get up. No. I don't want to hang, man. <laughs> I don't want to hang. I don't want to hang. I can't. I don't wanna... Hey, listen to me, Taylor. <laughs> Taylor. You kick and you kick Wade. and you shit yourself, all those fucks standing at attention, and they're laughing at you, man. They're 
laughing at you. I don't want to. I don't want to. Please. Don't let them hate me. St. John, in here. Overdose. God damn it. Bring the body outside. I don't care what a man's done. We never leave him for the freaks. I think you should... should stay up here and let me do this alone. What the fuck? You got a death wish? No. That's why I think I should go in alone. Look, even with Weaver's jacked up Molotovs, we can't take an entire horde all at once. No. So, uh... Right, I figure I go down there. I get their attention. I pull off a few at a time, and then I run like hell. And I gotta find some way to slow them down, maybe set a few traps. And then I blow him to hell. Look, two of us running around down there. It's gonna be chaos. We'll just pull the horde down on each other. No, you stay up here. You keep an eye on me. Shit goes south. You ride in there, you get me the hell out. Hmm? Unless you got a better plan. I got nothing. <laughs> Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Oh, shit. It didn't work? Oh, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. But you're out of a job. Hell yeah, it worked. <laughs> oh, yeah! <laughs> you should have been there, man. We really lit him up. Oh, man! We're gonna celebrate tonight. The officer's mess. <laughs> All right, looks like somebody's getting a promotion. Hey, man, you coming? Uh, you know what, let me, I'm gonna catch up with you. I gotta, I gotta take care of something first. All right, you handle that. <laughs> Good. I thought I heard you breathing. Oh, fuck you. That's what I want to hear. It means the shit hasn't broken you yet. <clears throat> okay. Why? Tat on your back. A dead dog chewing through its chains? <clears throat> Not something you see every day. <clears throat> I did some digging before we freed you. I was, um, I don't know, trying to make sense out of it. This was taken from the lieutenant when she came into the camp. My guess is, it's yours. Yeah, it's mine. And your wife's name? It ain't Beth. No, it ain't. And you've been out here all this time? Trying to find her? Yeah. You just asked me why. <laughs> Pretty simple, really. The way I figure it, any man who goes through God knows what to find his old lady does not deserve to die at the end of a rope. Well, wait, wait, wait a second. You're, you're, you're helping me? Well, that, that just means you're all gonna hang. We're not going back. 
The Colonel is batshit crazy. <sighs> Holy war, genocide, I mean, what the fuck is that? Yeah, well then, what's the plan? What are you gonna do? We're going east. Yeah. Hopefully we can make it to Reno. You should come with us. Nope. Well, you can't go back. The militia will shoot no, you on I'm sight. No, I'm not leaving without her. Uh, and I gotta ride north. I gotta warn Iron Mike. It's way too late for that now. <sighs> Why? They spent all night clearing the Santiam Pass. What? A convoy rode out early this morning heading north. Oh, shit. Are you sure you don't want to come with us? Yeah, I'm sure. Good luck to you, Deacon St. John. Hey, uh, uh, Corey. When I told the colonel about my military service, I told him I hated every goddamn minute of it, but, uh, maybe it wouldn't have been so bad if... if I'd served under someone like you. You know, maybe it's not too late.